Dr. Sala here, and I find it absolutely amazing that on Sunday nights during football season, I see an uptick in my analytics, and I look at the articles people are looking at, and it's all stuff about basically philosophies of the triple option and defending the triple option and, and anything that's close to that. You got a bunch of coaches trying to figure out about this offense that's only been around since 1964. So, defending the triple option. There's people out there that they want to know how to defend it or they think they have their answer. And Look, here's the bottom line. The offense has been around for 58 years and still going strong. Jeff Bezos trillionaire owner of Amazon says if something lasts longer than 50 years you better go all in on it because if it lasts the test of time and gets to its third generation you know it works so for those of you who came on here to, th to think that you were going to get a free education defending the triple option you want to know how you defend it have way, way, way better players than the triple option team that you're playing. Have way, way, way better players. Now, the things that Army and Air Force do right now don't really match up to stuff that you're probably reading on the internet about how to defend the triple option. Because with the emergence of the zone dive and how big a part of the offense it's become, Plus, with the zone option, the zone kick, they really are run more than triple option. The triple option, too, is now pretty much a midline triple option. So it's run pretty much when you decide that you're going to make the quarterback pitch on triple. So, in theory, if you want to stop the triple option, just don't make the quarterback pitch. Put your read on the dive and put your pitch on the quarterback. But guess what? Most of you are going to do that anyway. That's what I've learned in all the years I've been in business and beyond. You want an answer? You better have way better players. Because if they're running the modern day triple option, your defensive tackles are going to get triple teamed. And you're going to have to have a way to stop that. Good luck. If you can hold up to a triple team, you're going to win the game. That's what I mean by having way, way, way better players. So if you came here thinking you were going to get free advice, and eh, maybe you got a little bit. But in the end, the bottom line is this. The offense has lasted for 58 years. Air Force is 2-0 and all right now. They just beat a Power 5 team with zero scholarship football players, players that didn't even have Division One offers coming out of high school, because if they did, why would you join the military when you can go and hang out with beautiful women at Northern Colorado or New Mexico State or, gosh, even Montana, North Dakota, Idaho State. You'd rather go there than Air Force. Because you don't have to give your life to the government. But, so there's your answer. Have way, way, way better players. Good luck. You'll need it.